Hey. Good morning, everyone. There's a reason why I have all this makeup on my face right now. Um, today, I am going to be reviewing the vacuum cleaner. Uh, okay, I hate using my phone because all the text is always reversed. But I'm basically I'm reviewing the vacuum cleanser, uh, vacuum cleaner cleansing oil um, from the Fall Box. And if and like the reason why I'm wearing all this makeup, which I'm gonna take off in a bit, is just to prove a point that like um, oil cleansers are the best thing that has ever happened to me. Like more than applying, m more than like any other product I can think of. Because like if you're a regular makeup user, or even if you're not a regular makeup user, it makes a big difference. Okay, so like. What I have on right now are really, really heavy duty products. So I prime my face. I have the Fenty, like I have this foundation. It's actually a bit too light for me, so I don't use it at all. Like I haven't used it since I got one that was in my correct shade. But um, it's not easy to remove. It's meant to be long wearing. Um, I have on like ridiculous amounts of blush and highlight. All these from. Fenty as well because Fenty Beauty is it's just like it's God it's great um then I also ha I'm gonna put on liquid liner mascara and uh um a really and and some lipstick that's that's difficult to remove as well just again to prove a point that oil cleansers oil cleansers are seriously the best thing hi Dawn good morning uh, or good evening, wherever we all are. More or less done? Yeah. Okay, I'm not. I'm not doing this for like looks or position or anything. Just, just trying it on. Um. Yeah. So I, w I, I just use a liquid, liquid lips, uh, liquid liner. This is a water resistant mascara and those are such a pain to remove yeah so i just need to say i have been using oil cleansers since 2015 yes 20 no 2014 and the only reason why i was using an oil cleanser was because i had actually forgotten to bring my makeup remover with me while i was on a trip overseas and i went to a supermarket and i meant to buy my makeup remover and I ended up buying the wrong thing. I, I, I bought from the brand I intended to buy uh, which is Biore which we all, a lot of us buy our sunscreens from and then uh, I yeah I meant to buy the the, the clean, I meant to buy their makeup remover and I ended up buying their uh, cleansing oil by accident and I have fallen I fell in love with cleansing oils basically four years ago and I don't think I will ever stop loving them. Basically like it it, it get rid of all that difficulty in removing especially whenever people complain online about oh no the X mascara is so difficult to remove with a makeup wipe I'm like okay okay you need to you need to try this and this is the best cleansing oil I have ever used. I've used from so many brands. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna use this lip paint, which is another product that is like so difficult to remove if you were just using a makeup wipe on its own. But with a cleansing oil, it comes off so easily. Oh, it's such a pretty red. I forgot how pretty this red was. Yeah. So, um, what makes SB's cleansing oil like the vacuum? so special I think is um, it's just a really powerful product it's, um, even if you don't wear makeup and I actually try to use this even when I'm not wearing makeup is because um, it's just really good at uh, getting the grime out of your skin if I'm not wrong what what Adeline did was to use a very powerful but slightly dry, drying oil I think that was castor oil and then she combined it with hazelnut oil and rice bran oil, which are more moisturizing oils to combat the dryness of that super powerful like oil. And then uh, it just became this product. And and um, I don't really get grits, which is those like hardened sebum bits a lot. Actually, acids help me get rid of those easier. But this 
is definitely part of like the process for getting rid of them. Okay, I'm just gonna put down my phone and um because there's nothing to stand it against. Actually, can I use Yes. Okay. I am gonna oh, I if I had done that from the beginning, that would have been way easier. I'm gonna use the vacuum cleanser. And this is a travel size bottle. And then, like, this is not the bottle that was given to me for the four box review, actually. This one's outside, I'm too lazy to go out and get it. And my, 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 my parents are out there, and I don't want them to make a fuss about why I'm wearing makeup like this. But, like, I've brought this for a five day trip to Bali, in which I'm all with makeup just about every day. And another five day trip to, to, um, where was it? Macau. Again, wore makeup just about every day. So, and, and, I still have so much left after 10 days of using this, so um, I don't know, it's a huge endorsement. So you really don't need a lot, like, yeah, you you don't need a lot, I can add more later if I need to. And you need to apply this on completely, um, you need to apply this on completely dry skin, like water will kill the product completely, you cannot add any water to the bottle at all because um, the, the what differentiates cleansing oil from just using an olive oil and like using that to remove your makeup or whatever is just that there is an ingredient in this that allows the oil to basically um it's called a word right now there's a very specific word for it um but it basically like comes apart once water gets into it which is why like cleansing oils like within the makeup industry are all about um being really easily uh, oh my god like I'm clearly not awake today I'm not very articulate today but like yeah the cleansing oils basically are meant to just break down really easily upon contact with water so um, you don't have to worry about oh no what if my face gets really oily what if everything just comes off oh my okay you can see all the calm paint on my skin but the point being this removes everything Okay, I have a cup of water. This is probably not going to work very well, but I didn't want to use this in the bathroom in case anyone needed to to use the bathroom like while I was filming. Also, like the acoustics in my bathroom would be, uh, yeah, you'll, you'll, you'll basically hear lots of echoes. But okay, um, water coming off. Hi, Rachel. Hi, Natalie. Um, yeah, nothing to watch here. You're just like, let me wash everything off. So what some people like to do, and what I like to do sometimes, especially this is why I like to use the vacuum cleaner when I'm not, don't have makeup, is you just keep continuously massaging your skin. And when you do that, you can honestly feel like parts of your skin soften, and having the, the grit, the, the hardened sebum bits, like just break apart. Okay. Yeah, so without much effort, the stuff I put in my brows is all gone, my mascara is gone. You all saw how much nonsense was on my cheeks and, and everything, yeah. Um, yeah, it was vacuum and it was great. Mm. Okay. Okay, so if this review has not converted you to stop using makeup wipes and to basically use a vacuum cleaner. I don't know what will because there was so much on my face and it's gone. And um, if if you want you are in the market for looking basically for like the vacuum like not not necessary vacuum but for a cleansing oil. I think of all the sabbatical beauty um, cleansing cleansing oils and cleansing balms, vacuum is by far my favorite. Um, just because the cleansing balms as uh, I've only used rose so far, this cleaner, but like um, they're a little bit more effort to use because uh, you have to work a bit harder at getting rid of everything from your face, including like bamboo as well. Like you need to use a dishcloth or, or whatever, or a wet cloth or whatever to get rid of that. But you don't, you don't need it with vacuum. Um, it is just the best thing I ever like. Let, I want to okay, no. It's not the best. Like Sleeping Beauty is pretty high up my list of favorites as well. But it's probably one of the best things that SB has used. And um, I have like a full size bottle that I used. In se- I bought it in September, October last year. After all the reviews kept raving about it, I only and and just to save money, I only use it maybe once, twice a week, and I still have a fair amount left. 
So yeah, this is a fantastic product and you really, really should try it. Like, and even this, just like the sample size goes a very, very long way. Yep, I think that's enough for me for today. Um, bye.